Me weja anishinabe oma mikina kumenis North America ogi minan kichi nenda agok manidu ni swaso ina konige wenan Genwa zoat ni swaso awensiak ono ina konige wenan ki kenda mang kiwi ji go men aninji ejipi mati zang oma ke Kichi ayak ki abe pakwane ma ke wak anishinabe we ejichi ge wat no ngom O jo anin dine magnetak migani akin ene deshine khas kenyo do tem saging donji anishina benda My dear relatives I want to welcome you to the Turtle Lodge in this lodge we share ceremonies we share teachings and we share our identity as as the first peoples Not far from here is a very special place we call Manitoape which translates to where the creator sits our sacred site of Manitoape is acknowledged every time we say the name of the province of Manitoba it's important because there is where our creation as a people began in the beginning there was only darkness and silence but the sound of the shishigwan the sacred rattle broke the silence in the distance a shining blue light appeared and it descended upon mother earth from the sky world through a portal called bagonegi the hole in the sky and it landed on manitou ape this divine shining blue light is in each one of us this is your spirit The Anishinaabe people have gathered in this sacred place for thousands of years to have ceremony and to honor the spirit. One day a young boy was brought to Manitoba to fulfill a rite of passage, a vision quest. This is how a young boy became a man by being initiated by the first woman who we call Mother Earth. He fasted with no food or water for four days and four nights. Alone in the darkness, the young boy felt very afraid. As darkness fell, he would stay close to the sacred fire and wonder, "Why am I here?" It was the final night. His eyes felt heavy. Comforted by the fire's warm glow, He drifted off to sleep. Suddenly, a strange sound snapped him awake. He called out, "Hello?" There was no answer, but the boy was certain someone or something was there. He was no longer alone. <laughs> 